y'all i'm back again with another video thank you for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe in today's video um i'm gonna be talking about my native body washes and rating them i have about one two three four five six seven eight of them so which but anyway um so i'll probably let's see I'm not sure in which order I want to go in. I'm, I'm not going to go in any particular order. Um, I'm going to just smell them and rate them as I go. So, actually, I will start with my favorite one, though. This is the um, Toasted Marshmallow and Vanilla. And, ooh, I done got some of it on my nose. Anyway, um, <laughs> this is the Toasted... Let me come closer with this. It's the Toasted Marshmallow and Vanilla by native i haven't seen this um in like i get them at target but or from the target um app but i haven't seen it in stores lately uh, i did look for it again even though i have one here and one in connecticut but that's neither here nor there anyway it's not oh it's so good like it does have an after scent or something like that but this is my favorite of the ones that i have or one of my favorites of the ones that i have I'd give this one like a 9 out of 10, I want to say. Oh, it's, it's so good. I, like I said in other videos, if you've seen them, I love um, like vanilla, sweet, fruity, candy, like food smelling, snack smelling perfumes. I like smelling oil and like smell because I love smelling like a snack. But um, yeah, I'll give this like a I think I said eight out of eight of, no this will be a nine out of ten this will be a nine out of ten we're gonna start off strong and I, lo I love even like the little directions on the back it says lather sing and rinse um it's supposed to it's clean simple and effective so and this is not a sponsored video again I bought all this stuff before I like I fully started make or like bought a lot of this um, before I had really like started posting videos and things like that. So just to put that out there I am not getting paid for this by this company. I just have a lot of stuff a lot of body washes and stuff like that. I like their products um But it is like I, I do feel good about using this like because it's like more natural It's sulfate free all of their own um, body washes and stuff are sulfate free paraben free dye free and phthalate free and um I sound like I'm making a commercial for the oh, it smells so good. Okay, I have to go on to the next thing before this video ends up being too long. But I mentioned this in another video. I'm not sure if this video is out gonna be out before this or after, but it's the warm cider and cinnamon. And I'll probably just take a picture and include it like off to the side while I'm talking. But this it's like it smells like full for one it has like a you can definitely smell the cider in it it's like a little bit of a spice to it but also a little earthy and like this isn't one of my normal like go-to type scents but it does actually it does smell really good um and this i'd give Scent wise, I'm rating the scents, mind you. Um, a, like a seven, seven and a half, six, six, six and a half, seven. It's, it's strong, but it's good. Um, and a lot of these I use like with other stuff. Well, obviously. Okay, the next one is the Lilac uh, Lilac and White Tea. This is, oh, it's very soft and pretty and like, it makes you feel like, it, you know, it smells like if you were like sitting in a petal, like floating down a stream or something like that. It's so pretty. Oh, it's Lilac and White Tea. I don't know if I've, I've said that wrong, but... Oh, it's so pretty. It is floral. 
It's very soft though. And it's not sh like super, super strong. I will say a lot of these like, but I, but then again, I put on other scents and stuff after. But um, they don't like, they're not usually, like I don't normally smell them through my fragrances and stuff like that. Um, but anyway, and did I read this one? Uh, the lilac and white tea, I'll give like a six, a six. And again, these are just like my ratings based on the smell, based on how much I like it. Um, but anyway, the next one is coconut and vanilla. And this is another one that I, I like a lot. Um, it does, for whatever reason, have like a crayon-y smell to it. Um, the deodorant, I, that's actually the first native product that I heard of, their deodorant. And it doesn't smell like as crayon-y as this or whatnot. And oddly enough, it still smells good. Even though it smells, it smells like a nice crayon, pleasant crayon. I don't know how to, but um, it does like, it has some coconutty, I don't know, it's sweet though. The vanilla isn't like as strong as it is in the um, toasted marshmallow and vanilla, but I do like it. Um, is that weird that I like something that smells like crayons? Like, anyway, if not like, I don't know. I just like the scent of it. But this, I will, I, I am gonna rate it a little bit lower because of the um, the crayoniness of it. So this, I'm gonna give like a four and a half to five. I, no, no, I'm not, I'm not gonna rate it low because I actually do like it. Um, so I'm gonna go with like a five, five and a half. Or, yeah, five and a half. Me, me being indecisive. Anyway, I'm gonna give that a five and a half. The next one is one of their more recent lines, and I have three of them. I don't have all, I didn't get all four. But, um, is the Candy Shop Blueberry Belts Body Wash. And this one I like. It's sour blueberry belts. This one really smells like candy. I love this. This is up there with um with the toast. No, it's not as high up on my list with the toasted marshmallow. But oh, this this is good. I love how this smells. Like mm, 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 mm. it's it really does smell like candy. When you I did notice though when I put it on like a loofah or a rag or whatnot, like the scent changed a little bit out of the bottle, but um, I'm gonna give this like a seven and a half or an eight. Um, this, I like how like sour candy, I don't know what it is, but I love how it smells. Okay, and then the next one is one that I was really excited about. It's the um, strawberry and vanilla taffy. And oh, I, I love strawberries. So I saw that, saw this, I, I, where did I see it? I think in one of like my fragrance groups or whatnot, I saw somebody posted it and I was like, wait a minute, I've never seen that. Is that like one of the discontinued ones or like a limited edition scent or something like that? Then I was on Instagram looking for it and so on and so forth. I finally found it though. Um, and honestly, it's not, it does smell really good. It's really cute. You could smell the strawberry. It does smell like taffy. Um, you could smell the strawberry or whatnot. It slightly gives a little bit like a strawberry milkshake or like a strawberry shake or like one of the powdered um, mixes to put in for strawberry milk. But, ah, this is strong scent. It's not exactly what I was expecting, but I, it's good. It's up there. And then I have the, uh, what is this? Gummy bears from the candy shop line. There's, the last candy shop one is the cinnamon hearts one. And I happen to smell that in store after I had bought the rest of these and I didn't, it was okay. Um, but this one, 
I don't know what it is. It, it, like I'm thinking about the taste of gummy bears and like it kind of smells how they, how they taste or whatnot, but I don't know. I'm not the biggest fan of it. It's not horrible, but like, I don't know. Like there's, it's the uh, after note or something that, but it hits too quick. That like takes away from, like this, it, maybe it's too sweet or something. I'm, I don't know what it is, but this I'm, I'm a, unfortunately have to give like a four, four and a half. And this, normally I reach for this, like if I know for a fact that, and yeah, if I know for a fact that like, my perfumes and like my lotion and stuff like that it's just gonna completely overpower it because I don't necessarily want to smell like this but um and I've, I've used this only maybe like twice um but I don't I don't know like it's again it's not horrible I would say for this one definitely smell it before you buy it if you like are interested in buying any of them um Cause I, I do believe I've still seen these in one or two of the targets I've been in recently. Um, but I don't know. Maybe it's the gumminess or something. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. But and I keep smelling it, so obviously it doesn't like stink. It's just weird. That's what it is. It's odd. It's not what you would expect in a body wash. Maybe that's what it is i don't know um and yeah i said the rating for this is like a four scent wise the scent rating all of their like body washes and stuff are, are good I, I like them and then last but definitely not least is cucumber mint and i didn't did i get up yeah i think i did it is cucumber mint and this is one of like their I think one of their original scents or whatnot, like the one of the first of their scents that, or oh, it's one of the first of their scents that I've seen anyway. Um, like even in the deodorant or whatnot, I had seen like the cucumber mint a while ago, and this smells really good. It's very, like, it's very cucumbery, but you can, it's, the cucumber and the mint mix really well. And I don't know if you guys remember that, um, cucumber and what's it cucumber and green tea line no i think victoria's secret still has that out but there's another line too with like cucumber in it that this probably will go really well with i think one of them i know for a fact is discontinued but i think um victoria's secret has like one of their like relax or calm or refresh or something like that lines that this will probably like help bring out those scents more and it will smell really nice but this this is good this is so soothing and like Hmm. It's really, it's pleasant. It's very pleasant. It's not like strongly earthy and it's not strongly minty either. It's not like too sweet. It's a really soothing, like gentle scent. And this is high on my list too. This I'm gonna give a 7.5. Alright, that's all eight of them. Um, I'll probably end up with some more. There's a few other scents that they did have that I wanted to try. Um, that I've seen. One, one or two of them I did end up getting at Rite Aid, not Target, because I know I have mentioned Target several times. Um, and the scent that I was talking about that I wanted to try, I've, I've seen it right here. And there's a few others that I've seen, like one or two others that I've seen on the internet um, floating around. I, like I, I'd be interested in trying. So we'll see. I might end up doing another part two of this. But overall, like I was, I'm pleased with all of them. Again, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know your favorite. If you use native, let me know your favorite. Um, scent down in the comments if not let me know your favorite body wash and like what scent and stuff that and scent, ugh, scent and stuff it is all right have a good one